Hey everybody, Cardboard Jesus, we welcome. It is time to do the uh, Panini Illusions Football 8 box uh, inner case number 11. See base style come this way. Here's our case of a, of a channel. Your words, Chris Fitz. Your words. Speaking of that, I want to see, I want to watch that, the Panini Points video thing again. Oof. Sorry about that. You know, the infamous, uh, I, I don't know, it looks like Turkish maybe video. If you have if you have the link handy, rah rah, I would love to bookmark it. Oh no, Chris Fitz, you've never seen it. You've, you've never seen it. Hang on. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Let me go, let me go ahead and bookmark this real quick. Excellent. <laughs> I, I want to see the I want to know what the original interview is about But I can uh, I can currently recommend the Valley Forge Casino and Resort if uh, anybody uh, you know happens to find themselves in uh, King of Prussia, Pennsylvania, and needs a little uh, little kind of relatively secluded spot to uh, gamble and hang out at a uh, at a Radisson Hotel. For a uh, for a very fair uh, uh, price, I I, uh, I give my seal of approval to uh, to this place. I want to make my own. Yeah, see, I wonder what they do about that. I mean, because isn't that like a breach of contract in some fashion? If, like, I say that I'll sign for them and then I just never sign for them? Like, what? Is, I mean, how, what? what's the protocol? Or do they just not enforce that to not like piss off you know other 
other potential people. I did actually get to open some uh, some Bowman for Vintage Breaks. That was, uh, at, you know, at least something. Hey, Steel Curtain, how are you doing, my friend? Doing well. Open up a little bit of Illusions football right now. Just uh, chit-chatting about my, my uh, travels this weekend to uh, Pennsylvania. To, to break car to break vintage cards you know not uh, not this modern stuff but uh, some vintage business what are you up to that's that's where the show was. That's the show was in the basement. In the basement of the casino. And if nothing else, I learned how to play craps this uh, this weekend. I now fully understand all casino games. Craps was the last one that I that I had that I had some issues with that I didn't exactly understand. But uh between uh, Layton and John and a very nice uh, drunk man who had who had been been at the table for what I what I am guesstimating is about ten hours was uh, very very helpful in uh, in giving me uh, some information on it. I you know I don't I didn't drink so I don't know. I I I mean I saw a lady walk around like asking if anybody wanted drinks and the drunk guy asked for a Heineken. But for the 30 minutes that I was there after she after he asked for the Heineken I never saw him get it. And I know Layton and John like both bought their drinks. I did play uh, play a little bit of blackjack. Got to... well, I mean, he wasn't like you know straight blasted. He was just he was more helpful than a sober person would have been. As far as me, like you know, like you know, I was I would ask then I would ask Leighton and John like, well, okay, so what if I you know what if I do this? And they would answer, and then he would chime in, like, "Well, yeah, you. I mean, you do that, or you do this other thing too, like, you know, being being helpful." But no, I mean, I get it. It's, I mean, it's a fun game. It definitely is better than blackjack if you're, you know, if you want to drag your time out. Okay, see, see, I hadn't, I, I, since I, since it wasn't my deal seal curtain, I didn't know. Like, it just, they, you know, they came walking by asking, and I assumed that, like, in most casinos, if you're at the table, they, you know, they'll give you, give you free beverages. Because all she had was, like, a, on her, on her little, you know, uh, serving tray was, like, a, a cup with, like, tip money in it. But no, I mean it was an it was a I mean it was legitimately a nice enough place, easy enough to get into, to get around. We I didn't eat at the casino though. I will I I can't uh, vouch for the food there. Layton was like straight up awesome baller style niceness. Took uh, me and John to a place called uh, uh, Capital Grill. I I they have in Miami. So I know they're like a like a franchise, 
but I don't know if I don't know if how how many other places they have them, but it's like a a fancy ass steakhouse. So good. So good. Um, Layton's the one that looks like Vince Vaughn, kind of. Like Vince Vaughn's cousin, maybe. John is more, it looks like a little more Latino. I don't know. I honestly don't know where he's where he's from or what his ethnicity is, but he, he's uh he looks more Latino. But yeah, Layton's the one like we'll talk all day long about uh, about vintage, and and he can because he he knows literally everything about it that you would want to know. Great guy. Great, great guy. I can't. I mean, I learned so much from him. So nice. I mean, gen, I mean, genuinely nice dude. I mean, they, and I mean, there was stuff like in vintage breaks that I it, that I wanted to buy into. That I was like, well, shit, yeah, I, eighteen dollars for a shot at a at a second year Jordan card. You know why not? I mean, it's some stuff that's like four, five, seven, eight bucks. That you're like, you know, I mean, I, I throw it in. Maybe I pull a Ripken out of it, you know, for four bucks. You know, why not try? He did have one thing that I think I'm going to rip off. I don't know if you saw it or not. He has like a thing. If you spend fifty dollars, you get an ungraded card roll. And if you spend a hundred dollars, you get a graded card roll that he has ungraded vintage and graded vintage, like stacks. So, like you know, there's twelve cards in it. Oh uh, yeah, steel curtain in ninety nine percent of stuff that we do vet base ships. Ninety nine percent. Then the hang on, July. In like the six months that we've been doing this, only two breaks we've not shipped vet base in, in, in only two breaks. So this 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 one definitely does. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, Suggs. I, I call them clear cards. I don't know if they are, you know, what they refer to as not. Well, uh, 150 out of 150, Drew Will Preppers. I'm thinking about, I mean, just like ripping off, or talk, I'm going to talk to Gelf. I'm going to talk to Gelf about ripping off some of his eBay stuff. Because I mean the trick, and I mean we're we're friends. We you all know how this works. Is is you got a massive card at the top and bottom spot. Like it's hard to roll snake eyes. It's hard to roll box cars. But if you do, it's a big card. The cards in the middle, decent decent enough cards. You know, I mean so, I mean something you're you know you you're getting getting your spots. Plus, you know, you're getting, you know, getting a little something extra. So, you know, it's worth the fun, worth the shot. At water clear. I don't. I, I I'm gonna rip it off. I just don't know exactly exactly how I'm gonna do it quite yet. Uh, we got a Rams and Saints random. I get that A. Ron Rod A. A. Ron Rogers. There. Ooh, one of one, John Ross, NFL Shield Nike logo laundry tag first impressions cord.
I do. I well, I think he would be. I'm pretty sure that he would be receptive to the to the idea. Hassan Reddick to a hundred. Anytime, people. It is a nice card. It is a nice card. How are you doing this evening, by the way? Uh, we got a clear OJ Howard. And a Taiwan Taylor for the Titans. It's what I do. I pull nice cards. It's uh, it's basically what I was born to do. Mike Evans, another Buccaneer. We've got an RPA Denver Broncos, Carlos Henderson. Uh, this is the, hang on, let me make sure I get the number right, because I have messed this up before, 2017 Illusions Football 8 box intercase break number 11, Aqua Clean Solutions. This is Illusions number 11. Jabil Preppers to 150, I think that's a, that's a dupe, is, not, is it not, for the Browns? Joey Bosa. Corey Davis, 7 out of 102 color for the Titans. And I'll clean, I will do a, uh, a, uh, a recap at the end of this if you're uh, missing anything. Uh, Illusion 2 has not filled. So the uh, Dalvin Cook flawless is still in play. I got, I think nine at nineteen left right now. Kelvin Benjamin, uh, Panther Swatry. I don't even know where he got the Dalvin Cook from, honestly. I saw the promo. I see the Dalvin Cook, which is an excellent card. But uh, I think I got a 19 left in Illusions. Odell. Julius Pappers. Thurman Thomas, Earl Campbell, Oilers, and Bills. That will be a random. And a Brian Hill, 55 out of 150 for the Falcons. Well, I mean, ripcitycards.com. Uh... We've got some breaks in there right now. Uh, as far as eBay goes, eBay is like is full for the night. Uh, tomorrow is tomorrow is reload day for the store. So I mean, I just I added not too long ago a Chronicles baseball. If you have any, any interest in Chronicles, there's Illusion football number two. That's those are both in the store right now. Uh, Mike Williams Chargers. But tomorrow is going to be the big, big day of we got a bunch of stuff in, and it's all going in the store tomorrow. Carlos Henderson, Broncos RPA. And uh, I'll clean. I don't know if you have. I don't know if you bought from us before or not. Um, if you haven't. You can go to ripcitycards.com right now. You can go to login. Follow me here. You go to login. Under login, there's a thing that says register. You register. They're going to send you an email with a discount code for $15 off your first $25 purchase. Well, start a new email. Start a new account then. Hey, Cohen to 100 Nice auto for the Bears. Well, Wednesday I'm gonna work just during the day. Like Wednesday, I'm gonna I'm gonna do the 10 case break during the day. Jesse will still do Wednesday night. 
but I will I will come in and do uh, do that 10 caser during the day. Uh, Car and far random. Uh, Moreau to 150. Ten caser is on eBay, Devin. The ten caser is on eBay. It's it's all a straight player break. Uh, for the eBay one, the the paper player base is being sold as its own spot. So if you buy. Uh, McKenzie, let's say you're going to get all of the chrome, all the inserts, all the autos, all the parallels. Paper base is going as its own deal. It's, it, we got absolutely destroyed with sorting the last time we did this thing, so we had to figure out a way to cut it down to, to not delay so many things. Mahoney. Dobbs. RPA. Uh, Tom Brady. Big Beasley. All right, we're going to duel here. We're going to pull this out. 90-59 out of 100. Art Joshua Dobbs. And the amazing Nathan Peterman for the Bills. Four color on the Peterman. Two color on the Dobbs. That's going to be a random. Hey, Josh Reynolds for the Rams. Swat tree. So there is, I mean, there is stuff in the store to uh, to be gotten into. I mean, again, there's 19 left in the Illusions football, number 19. Still some good squads available. And giving away a Dalvin Cook, flawless. Uh, one out of 10 eBay, one on one Sapphire. That's redonkulous. Uh, Broncos and Bengals. That's going to be random. For net clear card, a Malik McDowell to two five zero autograph and a rack po Marcus Mays to two five zero. TB12 Tom Brady clear card. Marlon Mack rookie RPA Indianapolis Colts. My sleeve not want to get in on it. Leonard Fournette first impressionis. And a Galladay first impressions swatch card. Damn it, man. I can say I did see uh, ice on the ground uh, this weekend. 
There's Joe Thomas, Living Legends. That I have not, uh, I have not seen ice on the ground in. Uh, I want to say since 1997, maybe. I'll say about 97, perhaps. Three out of fifty. Uh, a Darius Stewart Jets. Nicholas, how are you doing this evening? Devonta Adams. Packers. Ryan Kerrigan, Swatry. Odell and Don Maynard. That is going to be a random. And we already got a hit on top. We will take it for Kamara of the Saints. Probable rookie of the year. TJ Watt. Clear card. A James Harrison. Clear card. And a dual autograph, 5 out of 15, Rookie Reflections, 3-color Trubisky, 3-color Mac Hollins. That is going to be a random. And a serious random indeed. Nice card. Bill Mack. Hang on. I gotta put this down. Dude, has anybody... I, I Again, no spoilers. But I just started uh, Mindhunter. On Netflix, has any anybody else anybody else seen it? Dupree to one hundred. Pack attack. Bruce Smith clear card. Dalvin Cook DC four for the Vikings RPA. Kareem Hunt, Swatchery. Uh, Dolph Fanatic, I have not. I, I was out of town this weekend uh, in Philadelphia and have not uh, I have not checked the mail since I've been home. But I, I will look when I get home this evening. Nathan Peterman. I almost didn't... <laughs> Didn't want to tell the wife that it was coming. McCaffrey. Alright, well, that, that was part of it, too. I wanted to keep it in secret. Don't want the Adams clear. And, uh... No, it's cold, James Bodine. It was like in the 30s. It's all back in Bradshaw. That's going to be random. Throwing Shepard to one five zero in Philly, yes, indeed. My my first foray into Philly. I didn't know. I assumed that it was uh, in like mid eighties, like it is here. Why why would I think any different? All I, all I took was my uh, my you know my uh, polyester gym shorts and a uh, and a cut off uh, cut off t shirt. Uh, VintageBreaks.com, a, a, a friendly company of ours um, that, that breaks vintage cards, uh, was do, were doing a, doing a show there. They were short, a little bit short-handed. They were like, who, who do we get to help us? They immediately said, we send Jesus. 
And uh, so I went and, uh, went and uh, hung out with him for uh, two days. Uh, rookie endorsements, Chad Williams to 50. Well, I wasn't, like, I didn't try to, James Bodine. I, I introduced myself to everyone as Jason that came into the room. I introduced myself as Jason. But somehow there, like, some people that I did not, I did not know came in and were like, Hey, CBJ, what are you doing here tonight? Or today, and I was like, Oh. I guess you know me as uh, as somebody else. Uh, to fifty four colors, Zay Jones. So I had to accept the uh, Jesus moniker, even though I tried to, you know, just play it straight. Um, probably not, Nicholas. Nothing. I no more select for sure. Michael Thomas, Saint Swatry. I mean, I think we've got like a handful of uh, of some other soccer, but you know, like older stuff, not not as you know desirable. TJ Watt five zero out of five zero eBay one of one. This one is a uh, Dolphin fanatic. This one is Ed Reed and uh, Barry Sanders. That's gonna be random. Chasen to 25 rookie endorsements. Wait, a ton of hits from what? Wait, what? Are you, I, don't, I don't know what we're talking about. Peppers cleared, clear card. Another Carlos Anderson. Uh, I would very much rather do them in the store, Dolphin Fanatic. I mean, eBay is gr is good for some things, not good for others. It's ideally a way to uh, Fitzgerald Clear to get get more people to the store, to the store. I know, Devin. It's sometime. Well, we're not done yet. Let's. We're not done yet. It. I want. I wondered what happened because uh, Barra, Barra Chin, came was in Miami. I don't. You got. You guys know who Barra Chin is? Portuguese dude. Jonathan Gibson, one fifty. Break soccer. He's a. Uh, he, yeah, he has a breakers channel. It's, it's mostly in Portuguese, but uh, he he's been here. I mean, he's been here before. Broke with uh, broke with uh, Bates and some uh, Chiefs and Niners. Um, I mean, he's not like important necessarily. He so Barra was here when it broke. Barra was here when it broke. Hey, nice. Kamara RPA for the Saints. Uh, another duel. 19 out of 25 this time. Vikings and Rams. Two color Cook. Two, three color Falk. This dude that was, I, I come on, I cannot get a straight answer from anybody about this. Was Barra here when soccer broke? 
Jamal Williams, first impressions. He was here. Okay. For for number one or for number two or for both? Cam Chancellor. Carl Lawson, autographs 250. For number one. Oh, damn. That, so number one broke on Wednesday? Because I thought he was, because he was here Wednesday. Wednesday it hadn't gone anywhere, really. And I thought he was just going to leave and, like, come back, like, some other day. All right, let's do the toppers before I uh, do anything else. Dude, I like Barr. I mean, Barr is a fun dude. He's very excitable. But he's, uh... Well, yeah. All right, we got a uh, Keanu Neal, the 25 Falcons. We got a Sue to 100. We got a Doug Baldwin to 100. A kaboom. McCown out of a hundred. Wait, hit, hit you a kaboom out of what, Nicholas? JJ Watts, twenty five. Aaron Rapkowski to a hundred. Matty Ice to 100. There's Kabooms and Select Soccer? And a Ryan Kerrigan to 100. Okay, so those are those. Let's do uh, an auto recap real quick before we do the uh, other thing. Which is the random Carlos Lawson to 250, a Kamara RPA Gibson to 150, a Carlos Henderson. I'm gonna count the Carlos Henderson. Uh, Chesson to 25, T.J. Watt to 50, Chad Williams to 50, Sterling Shepard to uh, 150, uh, Dalvin Cook RPA Dupree to 100, uh, Darius Stewart RPA to 50. Marlon Mack RPA, Marcus May to 250, Malik McDowell to 250, Dobbs RPA, Moreau to 150, Cohen to 100, another Carlos Anderson, there's only two, 150 Brian Hill, 150 Peppers, 100 Reddick, and another 150 Peppers. All right, now let's talk about random. This is how we're going to do this. This one is this one, this one, this one, this one. That one's up and down. Up and down. Okay. So we have got left and right, left and right, up and down. All right, this is how, this is how we're going to break this down. We've got left, we've got right, we've got up, we've got down, okay? I'm going to roll one die. If it shows up odd... It is going the uh, left card and or up card is uh, going. Wait, what do you mean, M Gibbs? I'm not live. I should be live, M Gibbs. If it is even, the right hand side teams or the down team 
is uh, is going to get the, get the action. So easy peasy as far as that is concerned. Here we go. One roll. It is six. It is even. So it's going to all the right hand side teams or the down teams. God damn it, man. All right. Thank you, everybody. We'll get this right out to you.